It may not become your favorite dish, but there is no doubt that insects are extremely healthy. They contain lots of proteins and are also a high quality source of vitamins and minerals. What's good for humans can't be bad for animals. That's why now farming experts from Europe travel to China to investigate how local farmers already take advantage of the protein-rich feed. Elaine Fitches of the Food and Environment Research Agency in the UK knows already today 70% of our agricultural land is needed to supply our meat production, which results in constantly rising feed prices. Within the European project Pro Te Insect, her aim is to help European meat producers to take advantage of this new source of proteins too. On a global level, I think there are three major things that drive this. We have a growing global population. There, people are eating more and more meat, particularly in countries like China. And therefore, we have a need to produce protein more sustainably. We're running out of land to grow crops, to then process, to feed to animals. And therefore, this, we're looking at a more sustainable way of producing protein for animal feed. One solution could be the common housefly, Musca domestica, which colonizes almost every corner in the world. Elaine and her team of international scientists want to learn how to breed the fly on a large scale. And here, in Huichu, north of Hong Kong, Chinese poultry farmers already take advantage of the insect breeding business. The new protein supplement not only reduces the costs for the farmers, it also improves the health of the chicken. Feeding the chicken with insects improves the immune system of the chicken. Also, it greatly increases the chicken meat quality. In the laboratories of the Entomological Institute in Guangzhou, scientists are checking the quality of the insects and search for possible toxins that may enrich within the feed. Within the next two years, results from European field studies with pigs, fish and poultry are expected.